Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The Mahindra's Light Specialist Vehicle LSV also called as Armado has entered into civil production. The Ministry of Defense has signed a contract with Mahindra Defense Systems Limited in March 2021 which worth Rs 1056 crore for an order of 1300 armored LSV to be used by the Indian Army. The delivery of the first lot of Armado has already commenced on 16th June 2023. On 31st January 2024, the Ordnance Depot at Avadi has dispatched the Light Specialist Armored Vehicle for the Northern Command of Indian Army. The Mahindra Defense is supposed to complete the order of 1300 armored LSV by the year 2025. The Mahindra LSV's key characteristics includes a powerful 3.2 liters, 215 horsepower multi fuel diesel engine with 4 or 6 speed automatic transmission, 4x4 with front and rear differential locks, 1000 kilograms of payload capacity. Almaro takes just 12 seconds to accelerate from 0 to 160 km per hour and runs at a speed of more than 120 km per hour. The vehicle gets ballistic protection of up to D7 level and Stenag level 2. This means that its armor offers protection against armor piercing rifles. The LSV gets protection on all sides, that is, that is uh, front, side, and rear, from ballistic as well as explosive. The Mahindra LSV has also been modified to integrate Spanish 120mm Alcaran motor. The Alcaran is a dual system which means it can be integrated with 120mm and 81mm smooth bore or rifled motors in a very simple operation providing high firepower and making it a powerful tool for neutralizing the enemy targets. The system's patented barrel cooling system allows for a sustained fire at a rate of 16 rounds per minute with no limit of time. Alcaran's software incorporates GIS technology and features such as zonal shooting and multiple rounds or simultaneous impact functions which simplifies operations, increases the motor effect over the enemy lines. The 120mm Alcaran motor system has a range of up to 8.2 kilometers. This system is designed for rapid deployment and movement on the battlefield, allowing for quick and efficient response to changing missions requirement. This versatile system can be integrated onto almost any 4x4 vehicle and its lightweight construction makes it suitable for helicopter deployment, offering high mobility and ability to adapt to various environments. It integrates with precise GPS technology to give operator an accurate location, making it ideal for the use in the battlefield. It features a fully digital fire control system, which again allows precise and accurate strike even in challenging terrain, weather conditions and features automatic aiming and re-aiming after every shot, ensuring high accuracy. The motor system remains inside the vehicle during trips and it is deployed from the rear of vehicle using an electromechanical actuator. In few seconds, it rests on the ground on a square base that stabilizes the platform and allows continuous firing at a maximum load without transmitting effort to the vehicle that transports it. The system can be deployed in just 14 seconds, aim target in next 10 seconds and then begin shooting rounds in next 5 seconds. It can nearly fire 8 rounds in next 39 seconds. The entire system can then retract in next 13 seconds. So in summary, the system takes total of 1 minute and 16 seconds to deploy, shoot and then retract and move away. This system can also be airlifted using the Mi-70 helicopters. The LSV integrated with the motor system will greatly enhance the shoot and scoot capability of army and also improve the survivability in the battlefield. The army is looking for 50 Mahindra LSVs to be integrated with Alcaran motor system. 
This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.